Yo, what's up guys, this is Happy No with another Guild Wars 2 PvP video and I wanted to say thanks for over 4k subscribers on my channel and for 1.3k million views on my channel within a short time again, which is pretty awesome and I also wanted to say sorry that I took so long to do another video now <laughs> and I hope you are not too mad at me I had a lot of work to do so I wasn't able to to record any other videos so I'm really sorry for that <laughs> um, today I'm showing you a fun build so don't take it too serious I really like this it is fun to play and I hope that you will also enjoy this build same as I did I just tested it out once or twice so I haven't tested it out that much so don't get mad at me if I fail here a little bit but it is, as I just said it, a fun build and I hope that you will still enjoy it. It is a Weaver Staff built DPS, which requires a lot of team support from your allied friends. But if you manage to do it good, which means to keep the distance, you are able to just, uh, how to say it, um, shred enemies. That's what I wanted to say. Okay, so this comp is nice. The threat that we have here is only the Revenant and only if he's a DPS player. The other ones we can avoid them. The druid not that much, but those three we can avoid them by keeping the distance and running away. <laughs> now I'm not so sure if I use Conjure Flame Axe, but I'm thinking of using it. Otherwise, hmm, which one? I wanted to use another one, but I'm not so sure which one. Um, <laughs> This could be nice. Improves critical chance. Burn your target and nearby foes. Mm -hmm. Firestorm. This one is nice, but the cleaves are also too long. Mm -hmm. I don't know. I wanted to use the hammer because the hammer has a nice damage. Or the conjure frostbow could deal also heavy damage. Let's go with the flame axe. I just need to test it out first again. Might. The combo attack here, throwing the axe. Uh, the dodge, the fire field. The five is a leap finisher, which applies also burning. After using a lava axe ability, your next lava axe attacks twice. Okay, so with the fire axe, we should be able to deal heavy damage, as I just expected it. We can do this. Mm, I'm a little bit too slow. Oh my god, I just failed that. <laughs> I just failed that. Points. Okay, Seize so theirs. I activate my glyph, and now you can see it here. If the enemy is trying to cross here, they are not crossing. They are not crossing. Smart decision. Da -da -da. I need to keep the distance, so my Ellie should go on mid now. Here we go. We lay down this. My glyph can join there. They've taken bear. Okay. This thief is attacking the pet or what? We can just auto attack him. Holy man, what is this thief doing? We can do this. Just dodge a little bit and now we can auto attack this guy and you can see it here. The damage output is pretty pretty nice. I just got him, I just got him. He should die. Holy man, just out playing Swarm Mega Thief. And look at this oh damage, 3.2k. Oh my god. I'm in love with this damage. <laughs> Do this. Heavy hit this guy. I need to be careful. I need to be careful. I need water. Chill. Some healing. Some more healing. We can now just destroy this guy. Oh my god. This is not even fun any longer. <laughs> Do this. This guy is immobilized and he's dead. Oh my god. No. The damage, the damage is so freaking nice. He's dead again. Come on, come on, come on, dodge, dodge, dodge. Heal, heal, heal. <laughs> I will get the lava. No, the lava's there, okay. This is really fun. <laughs> this was really fun. I just downed like three, four players. The thief just got me here. I haven't even seen that he swapped to thief. I was so confused. Never mind. You see, the enemy team is just destroying us. Awesome. 
I have no idea what the, my team is doing. Fire for this. Activate this again. Give this guy some swiftness. Like, he can't get swiftness. Okay, this is bad. I just do this. Mobilize this guy. He dies, he dies, he dies. No chance to survive this. Do this. Kill him fast, kill him fast. I need to kill him fast here. Oh my god, you really survived that. Deal damage, deal damage. Lava Fontaine. No. I'm not able to... I'm not able to get him one more time down here. But what is my team doing? <laughs> no! I have this freaking weapon up. <laughs> No, my team is so freaking bad, man. Where are you? Where are you? Go and cap a point. Look at this druid. He could have capped mid. Ah, at least we have this uh, holo smith or what the hell he's playing. He seems to be a smart boy. Look at this. Oh, yeah. Nice little decap. Sweet little decap there. Go on fire just to maintain my <laughs> damage. Okay. He almost have him. He, he's almost having him. I just do this. Port. Auto attack this guy. Auto attack him here. He should die now. He should not be able to survive. I need to remove my conjured weapon when I use it. Can I just he get healing? The thief is running away. No. Do this. Avoid this. Chill this guy. Oh, I perfectly dodged that attack of this guy. Jump onto him. Okay, I can remove it. I can remove it now. I can just auto attack him here. I removed it a little bit too late, but you saw when you use the conjured axe here, flame axe. You can also use the three to dodge attacks and of course for for the mobility but this is just a fun build guys now you see it here again with if i'm able to get it there on the point using this cleave remove the weapon okay now you see it here okay they just feared me pretty bad this guy <laughs> a thief i need to get the thief but i can also just attack everyone here Look at this damage. <laughs> oh my god, man. Look at this damage. Look at this damage, man. Where are you going? Where are you going, mate? This guy wants to... Wants to know it. No. Do this. Chill. Get some healing skill. Oh boy. You've taken Raven. I want to get my conjured weapon, but I'm not really able to. I can chase him. Oh my god, oh my god, and I'm about to die. Oh, I'm about to die. He won't be able to <coughs> stomp me. <laughs> he will deal to me. He will get too much damage. No, 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 no. Don't use the signet. I just need to use my skills. Yeah, now you see it here. Now you will see it here. Holy man, what is this pet? How did he just tell his pet to attack me from there? I mean, why? I will catch you, I will catch you. I will catch him with my auto attacks. Catch you with this. I'm not able to catch him. Oh, he just runs into that. I'm able to catch you. He has to jump down. Get some healing. Holy man. Chill. I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead. Okay. No. Dodge. Do this. No, I just have my golem now. <laughs> Too late to heal me a little bit up. <laughs> oh my god. No, I will just burn him here again. Look at this. Boom. Lava Fontaine. 
Come on, come on, deal damage. Oh my god. Never mind, I just need to drink a little bit <coughs> before I go on. I should use this build on ranked arena, man. If I get some decent teams with this build, I should be able to shred enemies, man. <laughs> shred them to pieces. Where is the team fight? I don't want to 1v1 because this build is not for 1v1. Auto attack. Hello. Dodge. My, 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 freaking, my freaking 2 attack here, my lava fountain is not working. I'm pressing it 100 times, it does not trigger at all. Do this. Holy man, this stupid thief. This stupid little thief, piece of thief, man. This stupid thief is just interrupting me the entire time. Okay. We do this. I'm not able to, I'm not able to dodge, dodge, dodge. I'm not able to. This guy can revive me here if he wants to, if he not wants to. He's not wanting. Okay, you are same squishy as you are good. The enemy team is still winning, man. How is this possible? We had double cap, three cap. Ugh. I mean, you can see this. <laughs> they are all running on close instead of decapping far. Never mind. I need, I need the last, I need the last ch chance here. Oh my god. Oh my god. Your enemy picked up an I need the last chance to get something, someone. Leap. I will catch this guy. I will catch. It's the mesmer. We will get him, we will get him, we don't let him run away. Hello. I will I just want to kill you man. Come on. Don't be so rude. He just leaved it. <laughs> He's here. He should die if he comes up here. Or I die, I die. My attack just triggers still. <laughs> oh, I will, I, I will kill him, I will kill him, where is he? I will kill him, I will kill him. <laughs> oh my god, look at this. Oh, die, die, man, die. Take this, take this, deep, deep, take it deep. Take a deep breath. Oh my god. Yes. Yes. <laughs> I am the carry. I will carry this game. Now I need to decap. I'm not able to decap it that fast. Maybe I will be able to... Okay, he feared me. This is nice. And now we can just do this. <laughs> Apply the damage. No, come on. Dodge this guy. Burn him, burn him, burn him, auto attack, auto attack the thief. Let him die there. Oh my god, I love this build. <laughs> I love this build. I love this build. I can't do anything but just deal damage. Just be annoying here. <laughs> Dodge onto them. Stun break. Oh, the stun break was pretty nice. I need to run away now. No, I wasn't able to use my healing skill. He will not be able to sustain there so much. Yes! <laughs> oh my god, I Your just turned this victorious. game. Do you believe it? You see this? I'm a pro staff weaver master god mode on. I don't know how I did it, but this was this was amazing. <laughs> Now guys, I will not talk so much about the build because it is just a fun build, but I'm going to show it to you and you can also, of course, swap as always. Sigil of Energy, Sigil of Smoldering, Marauder Amulet, Rune of the Pack for the higher critical hit chance and if we get some Fury, 80%, 81% critical hit chance, Fire, Arcane and Weaver, Burning Precision every 5 seconds, Pyromancer's Training, Deal increased damage while attuned to fire. Your fire weapon skills gain reduced recharge. Persisting flames com comboing a blast finisher with a fire field grants fury. Fire fields created by weapon skills last longer. Cast lava f uh, lava font when you are downed, which is this attack here. 
pretty strong one and it has a longer duration so you can leap into it more often um, arcane arcane precision we will have a 33 percent chance every three seconds to burn enemies or do whatever attunement we are here at damage to them well while we are normal attacking lesser arcane shield just because of the survivability it gives you three blocks it's a stun break if you are stunned with this attack or it is basically good because you can use here meteor shower and while enemies are attacking you you will get the shield so you will you will get the full cast of this attack and deal heavy damage evasive arcane every time we dodge we will have one of those attacks here burn nearby foes on fire heal ourselves on water blind enemies on light and on earth deal damage plus bleeding and cripple which is pretty strong on weaver i'm using superior elements every 10 seconds we get this critical chance increase by 15 percent dual attack skills weaken enemies attacks against weakened foes have increased critical hit chance by 15 percent which means if an ally also is able to weaken your enemies you will have 50 percent critical hit chance higher so 81 percent plus 15 makes uh, 96 percent critical hit chance against weakened foes pretty pretty strong uh, swift revenge gain swiftness when using a dual attack deal extra damage to enemies while under the effects of swiftness or super speed so basically this because of the swiftness we should grant ourselves swiftness when we swap here yeah when we swap on light so this is nice little bonus which which also allies can give you the other one make no sense basically it, it would have made more sense with weaver's pro prowess can increase condition damage and duration for a period of time after tuning to a different element i should have used this this would have made my burning 55 percent longer duration and with this build even stronger okay keep that in mind guys either this or the seven percent damage bonus those two here uh, elements of rage gain a damage bonus for a period of time when attuned to a single element gain ferocity based on the percentage of your power which we will get a lot of power um, I'm not, now I'm thinking to remove rune of the pack for the strength one and if we get a lot of strength plus the fury here from the combo finisher we should be able to get a lot of things going on and stack up to 3k damage hmm this is also interesting I just learned something else I'm using lightning flash for more mobility and which is also nice because you can use meteor shower and just flash yourself away if an enemy comes to interrupt you then conjure flame axe because of the combo finishers here boom combo finisher fire field when we get the fire field we get the fury and stuff like that area might we have here on the build uh combing a blast finisher with a fire field okay it's only blast finisher so it's this one here fire field blast we get the fury and we have here already 2.8k damage that's why we deal so much damage to enemies we do this auto attack dodge onto this guy have burning on him and you can see it here it is so so freaking painful to be an enemy here <laughs> use the elite to get the fire elemental and your fire elemental can also just deal here a little bit of damage also burn the enemies you can see it here the damage of the fire elemental should be also pretty nice but mainly i use it because he can apply also um, burning to your enemies you can interrupt yourself but the this guy should also be able to attack he should apply burning but he's not doing it now he is okay that's basically the main reason or you can use the water golem to heal yourself up and then just repeat and now you can see it here also meteor shower is pretty pretty freaking strong <laughs> look at this 4k per hit if, you, if the enemies are cleaving someone you are just able to destroy them you don't even have to to do a lot of things there you just can shred the enemies here like this combo finisher area might and you can see it here area might auto attack to get the might I would say you can also go with the rune of the strength for max damage output I would say repeat that dodge attack you saw against the thief burning retreat worked pretty nice pretty strong skill to just retreat and dodge an attack most people just don't know that and normally if I do this I should get blast finisher but I'm not so sure 
Mm, combo fire field, okay. We have a lot of utilities. So from fire to earth, we can use this and then eruption to get the additional, um, how to say it, additional might blast here. Let's do this. Fire field. Get the area might. And repeat that, I would say. Repeat it. Repeat it. No, I, f I just failed that. Okay. So with fire and earth, we can stack more might. That's nice to know. I should have tested it out a little bit more, but this is just a farm belt, as I said. And I will do later on a live stream some streaming with this build. <laughs> now, guys, I don't want it to take the video too long. This is a farm build. Don't take it too serious. It is fun to play. You just saw it. I had a lot of fun playing it. And I hope you enjoyed it same as I did here if you try it out. And now thanks all for watching. As always, three of my other videos. Plus you can subscribe to my channel and click on the notification bell to watch all my videos. When I upload them, you get a notification. Plus you can also follow me on Twitch to see me live playing and live streaming. I will do that a few, a few times a day. A week better said. And that was your happy no <laughs> with a fun weaver build. And I see you in my next videos. Bye bye guys.